Hello and uh, welcome back to another edition to GSS videos. I'm your ha I'm your host, Glenn Sam Sloan, hence the GSS and videos is what I do. This video, as you can see, is about God, right? Um I don't believe in God. I was Christian Protestant, right? Because my my dad's other family are Protestant, my mum's other cat family are Catholics. To me, they're both the same. They're both book and worship, imaginary men upstairs. They're both per, uh, preach from what I would say, the same fucking comic book. Yeah, that's it. The Bible is a comic book. The cat is inside this Bible, right? It, uh, I was this um, comic book characters. For instance, Virgin Mary it's supposed to be Jesus's um, mother, but she's a virgin. How on earth can she give birth all right, to a son if she doesn't have sex in the first place? All right? There's no such thing as God. All right? There's no such thing as God. None. All right? Um, but what you said, so, so how can Virgin Mary, how can the Virgin Mary be a virgin if she must be our Lord's mum? She can't be. The, uh, unless she, unless she, uh, she, there's no way she could have remained a virgin if she went down to the local sperm bank to get, uh, a little bottle or sperm, right? To inject inside of this of the of inside Virgin Mary to get pregnant. That's the only way she she can still remain to be a virgin, right? Because the man's man part has not entered her, right? So that's the only way. Yeah, she could be stuck, could be remain the virgin, right? Um, so, if God didn't have sex with Mary, but Mary is given birth to Jesus, that makes all of us, makes, it makes, um, <laughs> It's like, okay, it makes you think, think all years and years ago, there was that thing called a sperm bank back in their time, right? Back in that time, right? There was a sperm bank. I wonder what, 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 what was the sperm bank, sperm bank being called? Holy Mother of Jesus, Holy Mother of God, sperm bank. <laughs> you mean, Holy Mother of Jesus, sperm bank, or Holy Mother of God, sperm bank? What? <laughs> what? Right. Um. Is that? Is that why? It stops him from being. A, it stops him from being. A, well, it doesn't stop him from being a virgin. Then she's not had sex. So she could have been. I mean. Um. So that could only stop him from. That could be a virgin from doing that. Still. Right. But how can God be our father? Because in the Bible, it states, who would say in the Bible, it would state that he's our father, he's, he's our holy father, right? But then, on other pages, it contradicts everything it says on other, page, on other pages. So, um, how do we know that God's a man? How do we know that God's not, not as a man or woman? God could be a thing. It could be God. This, right? That could be God. Right? Well, they'll probably, all, all, them, probably all of them are. For instance, the sun could be God. Right? That cross could be God. Right? These work controls could be God. You know what I mean? Um, but, nothing. Right? That could even be God. 
that, and that is supposed to be the Big Bang Theory, alright? Um, I don't believe in God, because there's so much holes in the religion, you can pick holes in it. When, when I had them, the Holy Spirit is going to come down, I listened to him, I said, I went, and I walked to my door, they went, knock, 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 and I went to the door, and I went, and I started preaching, I said, uh, excuse me, are you Jehovah's Witnesses? And this was the, the first thing is, I had two, two ladies the first time in Hayfield in Suffolk, and then two blokes the second time in Hayfield in Suffolk. Right? And I had one, uh, well, not one, but, and I said, I've been here, I've had two women come here. All, all these people, these groups of people, have all been Jehovah's Witnesses, right? And all been preaching to me about God. I have. Hang on. Yeah. About that. That's when I lived at Moat Walk and Lark Close in Suffolk, and then I've been here in Lark Spur Close in Norfolk. Right? Not mentioning the times when I've been at my mother's or my sister's houses, right? And they're not doing my doors there on their doors, right? Uh, when they come and knock on my doors, I listen to what they've got to say, to be polite, and also be for a bit of fun. Uh, and when they're saying one thing, for instance, that um, we all came sort of from Adam and Eve, and I've, I then felt and said, hang on, how about this one? So we all come from Adam and Eve, right? So he said, Adam and Eve is our mother and father. So yes, but about God though, I thought God was our father. I thought God was our holy, fa holy, God, holy father, right? And a couple of them said, no, he's the Holy Ghost. He's the Holy Spirit. He's not the Holy Father, right? <laughs> There's always a couple of the Holy Witnesses said to me back in Suffolk, right? So apparently our mom and it, God, if he is, if he does exist, right, is our father. Next minute, he's not our father, Adam and Eve is our father, well, our mother and father. But if, if we all came from Adam and Eve, right, if every single human being come from Adam and Eve, how do they face, how do they come to this? Adam and Eve are a white couple. So what about the black race, the black country, the, the black people? How about the Chinese people? How about the Indian, the Pakistani people, the Polish people, um, and so the Portuguese, right? They're all sort of tanned, not the Polish, the Polish, the Polish, the Polish there was many others are sort of tan skinned, right? And talking the different language to all the rest of us. And we're all talking different languages. So how on earth are we related? If for instance, if you think if you go and build by Adam and Eve and say that I find our mother and father to become from Adam and Eve, right? Just think to yourself, are you married? Have you married, are you, are you, are you ladies, ladies, are you married? And if you're married, you're married to brothers, all right? And blokes, if you're men, guys, if you're married, if you're married, and you've married your sisters, and then what? If you married your sister, married your brother, or married your brother, that's incest, that's illegal, all right? You go to prison for it, all right? So, there you go. There's a major bob hole there, and I just, I don't like bursting people's bubbles, what am I talking about, yes I do. Um, um, then there you go, there's one hole, and I just burst that hole, uh, there's one air bubble in that, in that theory, and I burst that air bubble, right? How can we be all related if you're married, and, and if you're married, we can't marry our husbands, our, our, our wives, because they're our brothers, they're our sisters, they're our cousins. Right, they're our parents. Right? It's incest, right? And it shouldn't be. Now, 
right? Because incest is supposed to be is supposed to be illegal. But if you <laughs> so that's that. Uh-huh. I've also mentioned that uh, hang on, I said to him, hang on, says, I'm the Mr. Disabled, right? You tell me if there is a God, why would he make people with a disability? Why would he make everyone people with disability? I'm not saying make us all the same because yes, that would be boring. That would be boring. Um but all I'm saying is why make us with disability? They can make us different, but that makes us have a physical or brain in brain of dis a learning disability. Right? Um so and what I said but not least the Hobbes witnesses, not just the Hobbes witnesses, but other religions say the same said to tell me the same thing. That's not a curse from the from it's not it's not a curse from God, from Jesus. That's a curse. Not a curse, it's not a gift from Jesus. That is a curse from the devil. Right? Do you know what I say after that? So my patient number back in Edinburgh Hospital is six 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 two nine eight. Right? My mobile, my mom, my mother's mobile number has got six 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 in it. Right? I'm the mother, I'm the father, not the father. I'm the son of the devil. So why the devil, for instance, uh, curse his own son by giving him a disability? Tell me that, right? So how do we know that God's not a man? How do we know God's not a thing? How do we know God's not that the sun that uh, the sun that shines up in the daytime, or the not the moon that shines at night, or a cross, right? Man or woman, or this thing here? It could be anything. For instance, that microphone could be Jesus, right? You could bow down and say and pray to your Jesus. Um, and you can bow down and pray to your God. Right? It could be anything. Right? How can we be sure that our God, our Jesus, is what the people are saying is because they can't predict themselves in all of these stupid Bibles, which I must say, and I've said it before and I'm saying it again, the Bible, all it is, is an overpaged, overpriced, over compensated most of money right, is a comic book that's what it is it's a comic book um yeah when you die you don't go to heaven you don't go to hell right you get put in the ground and left there to rot right um you know what that's fine by me. It's fine by me. Because I don't believe in love. I don't, love in, don't believe in God. I don't believe in the devil. But I do love, believe in love after death. I do, I know I would love to come back. To visit my loved ones I've left behind. And to haunt the barbers that fucking picked on me the year, years ago. Chuck things out. <laughs> um, yeah. So... Yeah, um, I think what I've got to make it, what I've got to do is actually make a move now because I'm getting pretty pretty tired. Um, so I will go farewell, my friends. See you next. Uh, see you in my next video blog. Um, so have a good night. Have a good week. Have a good weekend. Good good month. Um, and see you in my next video blog. Farewell, my friends. See you later. Bye bye.